Hey everyone. So I've been trying to set up voice meter banana through Discord to connect to my Sam's broadcaster for a while. I am a determined person. So I got I got to the point where I could get things going except you could not hear the other person on your Discord call. I had everything set up exactly the way all the tutorials I went through told me to do it. What you see here, that that's that's how you set it up. Okay, that's how you set it up. Uh, you make sure you go into your your um your sound. Uh, and uh, make sure your recorder is set up correctly. So your voice meter output should be your default. Okay. For your playback, your voice meter input should be your default. Okay. Make sure you go in to your actual sound settings. And make sure voice meter input is selected for your output and make sure voice meter output is selected for your input <laughs> don't don't ask me input for output and output for input okay make sure that's selected okay I won't get into setting up um, the SAMs. Um, there, there are much better tutorials on setting up SAMs for your voice meter banana. However, you're going to come into this issue where you're still not going to hear the person you're talking to on Discord for some reason. Okay. So I got it to so the point. To the point. Or, or I fixed it. I fixed it. Okay. okay. I could I do a do voice test. Voice. But I still could not get it to go through onto my SAMs. It was not registering. Okay. I came across a post from like six years ago. And this person had an issue. And these people were giving the same answers I was getting in the tutorials. And then... I realized something. Okay. Voice meter. It has to go through your voice meter in order to register. I mean, it it's it's going through your voice meter already. But your the the audio you're getting through your headset is not being picked up by voice meter. That's why you can't hear the person on Discord and why it's not registering to Sam's. You know why? Because nobody's telling you to turn on your V-Ban. You have to turn on your V-Ban in order for a stream to go through. Everything else will work. Your voice effect will work. But you're not streaming the other person. So you have to turn on V-Ban. In order for it to work, you also want to go into your menu and set it up exactly like this. System tray and run on Windows startup. Um, this needs to be running. Okay. These two need to be selected. So turn on VPAN. <laughs> the most simplest feature, the simplest thing ever. <laughs> turn on your VPAN. Uh, and then it will work. <laughs> I think I've been at this for like, oh my gosh, years. <laughs> Years, people. When, um, uh, mind you, I was doing the virtual audio cables, which was more complicated. And then I found Voice Meter, and I think I found it uh, last year. Yeah, the beginning of last year. So, 
I figured it out. Turn on your VBAM, people. <laughs>